What's up, YouTube? Surreal Canine here, back with more La Mulana 2. In the last episode, we undid the remaining seals here in Heaven's Labyrinth, and we unlocked this gate. Oh yeah, we also got a, a laptop upgrade, or a tablet upgrade, rather. So yeah, that's nice. We can load more apps now. Let's go in here and see what's up. What is this? It's the Hall of Malice. Okay. I mean, okay. So that didn't really do anything for us. At least I don't think it did. Oh well. Can't have, can't be a winner all the time, I guess. It does leave the question of where to where to uh, go from here, though. You know, now that I have the, uh, oops. But now that I have the perfume, I wonder if there's something I can do in the twins' room. There was that vase-shaped uh, indentation there in their statue. Hermes, do you have anything to say? We did not create that machine. It's possible our ancestors created it. That machine simply seals off the Hall of Malice where the Giga slip. Oh. <coughs> okay, so maybe I can make progress in the Hall of Malice now. I don't know. You know, it's, uh... Oops. Yeah, it's more likely than not there's an actual item I have to use here. That's fine. Let's go to the Hall of Mouse. Actually, what would even have changed here? Probably not a lot, all things considered. is quite obviously where the uh, boss is. Uh, Alright, maybe I've hit a dead end. It really all comes back to, uh, to being able to get the feather, doesn't it? 
So, uh, I just killed a unique monster here in the shrine. If you stand in this corner for a little while, a, uh, a Nurikabe will appear on your left. Just stab it a zillion times with the rapier uh, before it crushes you against the wall and he'll drop his data. Not that I know what the purpose of this enemy is. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That doesn't actually help very much. Oh well. Uh, this was down here and I didn't notice it before. Okay, back in the ice fire treetop and I think I have discovered something important. This. In cant words in the midst of the ominous twisting swelter, the two words that will illumine day and night, it will lead to, that will lead to the underworld gate where Vidafnir waits. Hmm. And uh, from our glossary here, we know that Vidafnir is in the ice fire treetop. He's living in the deepest parts. Uh, that would be the one place we haven't gone yet. So that being said, the place where we have to use the mantras is probably down here. Whoops. So uh, let's save our location here. And let's try the mantras. Yes! Success! Alright, let's fight Vidafnir. Don't know what to use against him, but I uh, guess we'll... Oops, find out. Is he just immune? What? Uh... Not be harmed with ordinary weapons. What what does that mean? Um well right now it means I'm dead. Do we have any other hints about Vidafnir? To defeat Vidafnir, you will need the power of flame. Okay. Does the power of flame need, mean the fire scythe, or does it mean something else? Like a flare gun, for example. Okay, it does not mean the flare gun. <laughs> Had to give it a shot. Alright, well, that's one mystery solved at least. Which means we can get rid of that text. Great job on solving the Dark Star Lord's puzzle, by the way, but the bust of Mimir in that room continues to shine. Maybe there are still uncovered secrets remaining. 
Maybe there's a different way to interpret the arrangement. Hmm. Uh, I found this while digging around in the snow. Abzu, here in the ancient chaos beyond the quarter of blood, does he react to the Egg of Creation? Yes! Okay, that's something at least. Looking at this mural a li looking at this mural a little closer, I do have an idea what I might be able to do with it. Give me a second here. This mural, it looks pretty similar. Let's try pushing these guys into a position something like this. Try not to get caught under there. Yes! Okay, What? what is this? Where is this? Why is this? I'm here! Okay, this means progress. I'm gonna record my location here. Vidothnir lives at Idrasil's peak, at the treetop's highest point. Yep, we, we found him already. And because the tree is upside down, that means at the bottom of the ice fire treetop. Alokapala are united by Indra, a priest who has power over storms. I see. Now I can get through there. Okay. Valley of Bergelmir. We've heard about that, right? Conflict among the second children was orchestrated by Abuto. Blame fell entirely on Socket's shoulders, who was banished to the underworld living, condemned to have his intestines pecked for eternity. Huh. Okay, so Socket is alive and trapped in the underworld. Good to know. What's all this? Started it up with a flare. Eh, that didn't work. Hmm. Nothing comes to mind right away, but Bergelmir. Uh. Now that we know that name, we should. Probably. Oh, hello. What's this? Goodies. Okay. I like me some goodies. There's some kind of boiler or something, but it's not working.
Uh, yeah, that's what I thought that would be. was dead. <laughs> well, that was embarrassing. Uh, let's go back there. Oh yeah, by the way, hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. We're playing La Mulana 2. <laughs> Not that I know what you would do with that knowledge, but hey. Oops. Anunnaki emblems. They will be a thing when we uh, get to exploring the uh, ancient chaos even more. Forever ago, we got the carrot. You can kind of see uh, horizontal lines on the uh, on the mural where the two statues are supposed to go. This ice doesn't look like snow doesn't look like it. some weights and let's say I return once I have actually figured out what the significance of Bergelmir is Brahma created the world he sealed the light of creation's origin in a golden egg all was created from the colors of the light emanating from the egg the light the creator deigned to speak of will be unleashed first child Anunnaki Okay, we've been doing that already. Hmm. I think I may have figured out how to open this chest in the uh, Immortal Battlefield. Poke, poke. Yeah. 
What is this? The dinosaur figure. Oh, that's what I've been missing. All right, now we can uh, enter another part of the immortal battlefield. I also could have gotten this a lot sooner than I did, but uh, eh, blind run. It's bound to happen, you know. Let's uh, get some place where you can actually use this. Ooh. Yes, now the gate is open to us. Altar gate. Let's enter. New message. What's that? That structure wasn't in La Mulana. Check it out thoroughly. And carefully. Indra. Storm-based magic is not to be taken lightly. Is that a Temple of Doom reference in the last line? Was it you who raised our guardian Jormgand out of the water? How amusing. think that one would come all this way to fulfill our ambitions. I shall call upon the Ankh of Jormungand. Go, throw away your life as you so clearly desire. You are but a nuisance. Die! Could have gone much better. <laughs> Sorry about that. It's not where we need to be. Let's go heal! Because if this turns out anything, out anything like Palenque, I am going to need all my health and a heck of a lot of uh, weapons. Let's buy some shuriken ammo. You know, since we got so much money. A hundred should be enough, right? Right. Alright, uh, let's save our game, first of all. But, I mean, we've got plenty of health, uh, possibly even more than the game expects us to at this point, because they took so long to find the dinosaur figure. This guy and his bombs, ugh. The onk. Here we go. Fifth guardian. Is this a chariot? Oh. 
Oh. Uh, this is totally a, uh, a chariot battle. going poorly. the axe uh, he takes a lot actually no I think I want to use the rapier here just for its uh, oof, longer reach yeah Taking a lot of hits, but that's because I did not know what I was doing. Now I kind of do. Oops, I mean, I say while I ran face first into him. That could have gone a little better. But yeah, this is easy. Alright, let's turn on the chariot. Okay, yeah, I think I'm gonna... Actually, I wonder how well he'll fare against Caltrops. <laughs> uh, turns out they're kind of... it's kind of hard to hit him. And get them. I don't know. Try the axe. Ooh. Now, this isn't going very well. Oops, I messed up the timing. not the thing I intended to do. The katana, oops, the katana has a pretty long reach. Sonic Hedgehog. Mr. Hot Rod. Chariot Man. They're like Iggy Koopa in Paper Mario Color Splash. Ow. Oop. I 
I've almost got him. I just need to uh, not get hit by something dumb. Gotcha! Finish him off with a sword. Ooh! Uh, I'm lucky I didn't die there. I wasn't paying attention. But yeah. Congratulations! You have obliterated Jormungan. But the adventure continues. Kicking rad. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> like father, like daughter, I guess. Twined Malice, it says. That's the achievement I got. And I got Mjolnir! Yeah! I know where to use this. Let's go to the mausoleum. Actually, I think I am uh, too far down. Might have to uh, go through the corridor, which is fine. It's just a quick trip to Valhalla. in that general direction and let us proceed oops Okay, equip the Mjolnir, first of all. Alright, Mr. Uh, Angra Menu. Yeah, we just gotta crush him. Now, is easier said than done with the uh, how this how his tongue is getting in the way. Dang frog. Well, I guess it's not a frog with a lizard of some kind. Still annoying. Yeah. Alright, I just gotta crush him. Boom. Feather acquired. Seek a higher place. So yeah, now we can finally double jump. It's great. It's really great. Let's celebrate by uh, going up to the top of here. I don't know if I can get that high up. Actually. Oh, I sure can. 
What's this say? Amit, the monster that feeds on souls. It hides in a garden, cloaked by the power of stars. So yeah, now we can get to the uh, top area of the mausoleum. Whoa! This looks like a garden of stars. Am I going to have to fight yet another mini-boss? Probably. But maybe not just yet. The pyramid crystal restrains the power of the stars. It wreaks havoc on that which hides the power of the dark star. That sounds uh, very significant. Seeking power, we attempt to move closer to the sky people. However, we did so not knowing how it would benefit us. We know that only a sage able to harness the power of the Dark Star Lord and smart enough to get, be able to gather all of the wisdom left in Aglana shall have knowledge bestowed upon them. I see. Well, let's go heal and uh, try that pyramid crystal. I feel like the game just got a lot wider for us. It may be in my interest after this blind run is said and done to uh, play La Milana 2 again now that I, uh, now that I know a lot more of what I'm doing. Let's go. The feather. It's a great item. Not that item, the, uh, the pyramid crystal is what I want. Amit. some strong health drain. Also, I could save myself a lot of time by teleporting up here. Let's uh, use the... Let's consider using the axe for this. don't entirely know what I'm doing, actually. What happens if I, uh, if I get behind him? Not a whole... <laughs> well, that's just silly. Oop. Okay, yeah, maybe this was a bad move. I feel like I should be able to kill him now, though. Just need to uh, do it better. Shots are actually very hard to avoid there, Amit. Oop. Get away. Yeah. Oh, 
Actually, what am I doing? I can duck under that last one. Yeah. And now I can't. Ooh. Whoops! <laughs> that was a fail. Oh yeah, I can double jump now. <laughs> I'm a derp. Oh well. Seriously. Should not be that hard. Doing too well, am I? Nope, that didn't work. And he landed on top of me because I couldn't get out of the way in time. Ooh. I've got to work on my timing. Come on, let me hit you a few more times. Actually, I totally missed my cue there. Aww. Oops. Gotcha. What's in here? The vessel.
What's up with your dad, anyway? He ignored my request and you showed up instead. What's he doing bringing his dad here? Your dad and grandpa being in the same field and whatnot, they used to be real competitive about the research and stuff. Your dad would usually get, end up getting his results ripped off by your grandpa and would always get super pissed about losing. I guess child rearing in the Kasugi family is also kind of like a test of parents, huh? Oh yeah, maybe he came to watch over you? And then, you know, rip off your research. What a weird-ass family. <laughs> Alright, we got a vessel. Uh, no telling what that does uh, right now, anyway. Why does this area exist? Oh, wait, it's because uh, Castlevania. <laughs> right. Oop, let's try not to get crushed by that. Now we can get up here. What's here? Rose and Camellia. Cool. Frog games? You mean like frog fractions? <laughs> but, uh, yeah. I am really happy with what we accomplished today. Because I can finally double jump. Let's heal up, let's save our game, and that will be that. And then I'll see all you guys next time. Bye-bye for now.